Now for a story of real community spirit, all to help a five-year-old Carlisle girl. Olivia's story had to have both legs and part of an arm amputated after contracting meningitis as a toddler. Now her parents want to make sure that as she gets older, Olivia can live life to the full. So a group of local runners have stepped in to do their bit this weekend. Helen Ford reports. <laughs> life hasn't been easy for Olivia's story and her parents. She became desperately ill with meningitis at the age of two. Part of her legs and one arm were amputated in order to save her life. Olivia's prosthetic limbs are provided by the National Health Service, but her parents hope that once she reaches her teenage years, she'll be able to have the most sophisticated legs available. And that means paying for them themselves. So the fundraising starts now. <laughs> Many of these runners didn't even know each other or Olivia before they signed up to her cause. But they're showing real commitment, aiming to raise thousands of pounds at this weekend's Great Cumbrian Run. Natalie Brown took part in the half marathon last year and is delighted to be tackling it with a special goal in mind. Just every little help to, towards Olivia. It just, it, it just feels so good this year, you know, doing it to help her. You know, just, it, it just feels so right this time. And I suppose you must have got to know Olivia in the, the process. Yeah, well, I, I met her the first time the other week and she's, she's just amazing. She's, so, she's just full of spirit. She's, I'm just so happy we're doing it for her. The level of support we've had from the people of Carlisle has been absolutely phenomenal. We've been, we've been absolutely touched yeah. by, by all the things that people have done and how, how very generous people have been with the time, the money and the thought. Do you think Olivia herself realises just how many people are getting involved to help? I, absolutely not, no. She doesn't really <laughs> understand. She knows that a lot of people do uh, a lot of things for her, um, time, effort, uh, money as well. So um, she, she understands that but doesn't understand the big picture. But she will do when she's older. It's no surprise that Olivia's parents are determined to give her the best chances in life. But it must be heartwarming to know that their dreams are shared by many others. Helen Ford in Carlisle. And a big hello to Olivia and good luck to all you runners. Training for a half marathon mm -hmm. at this time of year, it's hard work. <laughs> You've done yours for this year, haven't you? <laughs> I certainly <laughs> have. Enjoy it.